lights, action sound, oh the sound. My whole relationship came to a head pun a week ago. There's so much history that goes into this story but I'll try to keep it a short easy pun read. Six days prior. I sat next to the skank who I have helped out so many times in the last 10 or so years. She was at my favorite bar, next to my favorite spot, so I sucked pun it up and sat next to her. Our conversation was with pleasantries. She shared yet another hardship in her life, and I, as per usual, had tools to help her through this challenge that she shared. She needed items for her family that recently moved in with her. I had these items in storage and offered them to her free of charge. She accepted. Six days later I had collected these items and brought them home. Years earlier. She changed her number and I was happy not to have it in my phone. So the day I brought them home, I told my spouse to tell her the items were at our home. He said, why don't I just bring them to her? I replied nope, I got them for her, she can come collect them here. So he sends her a message and she's at our house within 20 minutes. I stayed in the house for I was exhausted from tasks from the day. Years of being used and exploited by her had my gut screaming at me so I checked the cameras that are on a short delay to shockingly see her generously and lovingly giving my spouse a blow job just on the other side of a wall from where I was. By the time I saw the act and from the camera delay, the deed was complete and they went to a neighbor's home. I lost my shit, called screaming at him to come home. He was there in an instant and I yelled really a blow job in my house. He denied it until I said I had video, in living color with sound. Oh the sound. Fast forward, it wasn't the first time. He admitted to a handful of times, just the first time being caught. This is why I didn't have a good feeling having him deliver to her home. Then came the gaslighting, the blame. Of course this was my fault. I packed a bag and left. Contacted my most trusted people who surrounded me. Of course I showed the act. One cried, one lost their appetite. One asked me to turn it off and several refused to watch. I guess I'm not sure how telling this short story will help me, but if there is any lesson learned her is trust your gut and don't allow people to keep using you. The excuses? It didn't mean anything. Her husband died. It wasn't cheating. I'd forgive you. You put the cams in there on purpose. Those were just a few. I guess she's called the town whore for a reason. I just became another notch in her headboard. What do I do now?